City of Gary's first hack night, a partnership with the Legacy Foundation and IU, uh, IUN and Cure here. Uh, Legacy Foundation has helped the City of Gary through a program called Gary Counts. It's a joint uh, grant application that we put together for the Night Community Information Challenge grant last year. We were a recipient of that grant. The Legacy Foundation helped us procure $80,000 $80, in, in cash and in kind contributions to look at um, how the city communicates its data, uh, particularly with blight, uh, abandoned properties, uh, dilapidated properties. And as part of that event, we had a, a Gary Hack Lab, which is basically a convening of people who work in data, people who utilize data. So we just had a meeting with about 30 people from the community, uh, city employees, and folks working on data. And the goal was to just have a conversation. Like, here's the data we have, here's where we're trying to show it and what can come from that. So I think this is the first and exciting conversations and an exciting path going forward of how we share information with the public and how we uh, engage in government here in the city of Gary. And thanks to Legacy Foundation, thanks to IUN Northwest for hosting. I'm Tina Rogers, the Interim Vice President with Legacy Foundation, and we are a, a key partner with the city of Gary in bringing Gary Counts uh, into being. And we are funded through the Knight Community Information Challenge Grants. And what Gary Accounts is about is bringing government data online in, so that citizens can have information and become more engaged and uh, empowered by that information. So today we were having the Gary Hack Night. This is our first introduction to uh, what it means to bring um, technologists, developers, policy people, department managers, researchers and just general citizens, the public together, to say what is the type of data we want to see, what format do we want to see it at, and can we do it on our phone, can we do it on an iPad, can I pick up the phone, call and make a difference, so that information is more readily available to those of us that want to move data into action. I was very happy to participate in today's session. Uh, this is really a starting point of how do we consolidate information and data in Gary to make it more accessible and open up a whole new world of opportunities. You know, from this point forth, now that this conversation has started, we're going to see new applications being developed for the web, new applications being developed for mobile, and more importantly, we're going to see this information creating new opportunities for the citizens of Gary. Tonight was our first open data hack night. It went awesome. Um, we had a great turnout. Um, these um, events will start to stack up and allow the city of Gary to take a prestigious leap toward regaining our, our ability to serve our citizens and to, and to continue to um, lean in the right direction. Uh,